Yeah, do it, Douglas. I'm gonna repeat it. Douglas. It says you probably, you got cut off, I'm sure, after I hit do recording. It, okay, here we go. There's always that like couple second delay between you hitting the record start button in OBS and it actually oh. capturing. So every time, and every time it's either I mess up and I just start talking too soon, or you, as soon as I say let's do it, you say something as I'm hitting record, and it always just gets cut off. Yeah, why, why ever change anything? I agree. Stick to our why past ever... mistakes. Yeah. Okay. Did you see the? In, I don't know if you update your OBS frequently enough, but did you see they added a pause button to recordings? Wait, really? Yeah. So hold on, it actually will maintain the pauses. same file, but it will yeah, stop. It just pauses it. What? Yeah. Okay, I actually need to update OBS. Oh my god. Okay, all the way back down. Nice. Wait. So we instead of a nice little feature for streaming, so if your internet starts being bad, it doesn't just like make the quality um, like it doesn't just like go all over the place. It'll like. Bring it real like low, and then it gradually goes up. So it's more of a gradual like huh. bit rate recovery thing. Interesting. Yeah, dude, I I need to. So the record pause button basically, instead of me stopping and starting a bunch of clips, I could just have one clip. Yeah, if you had like a like a thing that you were doing like just a little bit at a time or whatever. Yeah, I mean that would be super handy for like all of the recent uh, recordings. Although it actually might make my job a little more difficult if there's no like. Oh right, because you don't know where the heads and tails are. Files. Yeah, that's true. Because I sometimes like it could be a second before I start talking, or I could be like not talking at the end of a thing. It's a good point. It's a good point. Yeah. But it could be useful too for certain situations. Could be. If you're just going right from some one thing to the next thing. I suppose so. Yeah, maybe. I don't. I don't know. I'm not sure. It could actually. What it could be useful for is, you know, instead of, yeah, maybe not the stuff that's gonna be going up on the main channel that's being recorded for the sake of recording, but it could be like, if I'm doing a uh, live stream and I wanna trim out, I could do live editing, essentially, for the live stream VODs. Oh my mm. god. Cause like, okay, say we're about to do something real grindy or I'm just gonna be standing in front of something oh, yeah, for a you while. Can record and stream separately. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. I never even thought about that. Mm-hmm. But the problem is because I upload everything unedited and I don't want to have another job of editing for the second channel. Like yeah. I uh I don't want to just separate the recording clip, so I'd still want to only have one file, but this could enable the one file to actually be edited already based on my live input. So now, I don't know, though, if because the this channel that this stuff goes up on, like, people are so used to things being uncut, I don't know if maybe they wouldn't It'd like that. Alien. Yeah, I don't know if they'd be like, whoa, 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 we're used to the uncut stuff, we're fine with you doing boring, grindy things. Um, Bridget says, don't you dare start editing Kevin Sparkles 2. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. What a, what a situation where people are like, don't edit. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's not going to work. Yeah, how dare you increase the production value of your content? That's illegal. Leave it as is. Wait, what are we what are we doing here? How did you What? What's up? Oh, okay. I was confused what that platform behind was doing. I keep thinking this this thing is gonna be like a one wheel and it's Oh not. yeah, because it's red. Yeah, it's... <laughs> the one wheel. I'm a tech startup guy. Isn't that what those things are called? The one wheels? The front wheel, back wheel maps. Or the FW... No, I'm talking about the thing in real life. You know, Have you ever seen those, like, the dudes that, like... You know they work for, like, some some tech company, but then they... It's the little... Rather than using, like, a scooter or uh, those, like, hoverboard things, it's just the... It's I think they're called one wheels, where it's just the platform with the w big wheel in the middle. Oh, is it actually yeah, called a one wheel? Yes. I think yes. it's called a one wheel. Okay. Huh. The one wheel. I hadn't heard it called that before, but I guess that's a thing. Yeah, yeah. You've seen that, right? Um, yeah, no, I have I have, but why do you say they work for a tech company? I don't know. I think that's it's like the more pop <laughs> like 
not everybody, obviously, but I feel like it's popular among that group of people. Hmm. It just sort of has that aesthetic where it's like, look, it's a single wheel and a computer is balancing it for you. Or I, I, I don't guess. Know what... I don't. I don't know. I never got the impression it was like a tech crowd thing. Um, the, all the people that I see on it usually are like nerdy people. It seems. Are they in like? They're kind of in like nice clothes, but they're also like yeah. sort of quirky, casual, yeah, like way. button ups and stuff like that. Uh huh. And, like they have like a backpack on or whatever. Right, right, right. The uh, I love that, that that thing has like a like a all terrain wheel. Like you're supposed to take it off roading. Which I guess I'm sure some people can. do. They're off road segways. Yeah, I mean you can, but it seems like it would be so sketchy. It, Probably better once you're used to the thing, though. I don't know why, but I really like the texture on the the pink blocks. Like they have this brushed steel, and the color is kind of nice. I don't know why; it's very satisfying to me. Well, I'm like halfway through the map, so I don't even know if I'm seeing the same blocks that you're talking about. Mm. I can't. What is happening to me? This is not. Good. Oh, we we do have an advocate for the edited streams now. In uh, something in is chat, there? yeah, dude, we got fish. D fish disease X. I still don't know if it's if it's supposed to be fish sticks or if it's fish disease X. But anyway, um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, dude. It's a uh, it's it's a tough call to make. It's a tough call to make. You'll figure it out. I don't I know. I could you. try it, and people would be like, "I hate this. I want to. I want to watch you standing in place for an hour while you do yeah. something grindy." And some people want something that just takes longer, though. Like, they want something they can put on while they work or do homework or... I guess. Kill just... anime beats to study, too. They just want a podcast in the background. Okay, it's Fished ZX. All right, glad we're clarified on that. Z... ZX, actually. Oh, perhaps, yes. Okay, mess that one up. It's Mr. Fish. Yeah, how did we how did we get that uh, change in um, how we identify like not uh, Z H H H H D P V R? Um, yeah, I don't I don't know where where those came from. Like when were the colonists back in the day? Did it was they say our fault. Z and H? And and not. I don't know. I've. I'm sure someone probably has like a. I don't know. Like created some sort of semi-accurate old-timey accent, but like I want to know what that transitionary American accent sounded like. Yeah, I agree. I bet it sounds weird. <laughs> it, I mean, like how if, people... if, if like you have an American friend that goes and lives in like in London for like five years, and then he comes back and he's got like a weird twang thing. I feel like that's point, that would be. I don't think in five years you'd completely override your no. It accent. wouldn't completely like, do anything, but you definitely have a little bit of a something. Hmm. Like how did how did Lincoln speak? Because that was what like. Wait, where are we going from here? Uh. I don't know. Watch the Daniel Day Lewis movie. Oh. Okay. I mean, are there any actual voice recordings of Lincoln though? I'm just feeling like <laughs> no, that's I a don't nice. Think they had any... Yeah. <laughs> they didn't have any voice recorders back in the day, so... Well, that's that's the thing, is actually, uh... Uh, image came before audio. Even though audio is... seems more simple. What is this? Uh... Oh. You just have to go forward. Oh, you have to hit the... Oh. That is... Why is there no visible button? I know, I know. It was, it was silly. It was, uh, not really indicated. Terrible. Okay. Just terrible. Is that your feedback on the uh, game design? No, I'd like to speak to the map maker. Whoa. Okay, that was a pretty cool finish, though. You're like, where am I going here? And then it just, and then it just goes. I can. Yeah, I, I had to take a couple tries on that. You only had to take a couple either. So congrats. Oh, oh, oh. It was close. Save. Yeah, you're fine. You're fine. You're gonna make it. Oh. Oh, don't say that. Unless you don't make it. I mean, then there's don't also that. that 
potential issue. Oh, 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 I thought you were gonna nosedive. Is this it? Yeah. Oh, <gasps> yes! Wow, two seconds left. Oh my god. Too close. Nick is the Karen of the Trials community. What is... Janine! I, I don't know what that means. I think it's a bad thing. I mean, Isn't the Karen the person with the... I want to speak to your yes, manager Yes, I want to speak to your manager. Customer service, please. I'm right, you're wrong. Um, like to speak to your manager, please, because you didn't put the pickles on the side. I don't know. First thing you come up with. All right, farewell. Have a good one. See you next time.